So today we're going to talk about the Black and Tans, part 2. So between 1919 and 1920, during the Irish War of Independence, the RIC had no idea how to deal with the guerrilla tactics of the IRA. This was something that they weren't used to at all. So essentially, they needed reinforcements. So there were seven main people involved in the Black and Tans coming to Ireland. Number one was David Lloyd George, who was the British Prime Minister at the time. Number two was Sir John French, or Lord French, he was the Lord Lieutenant of Ireland at the time. Number three was Hammond. Hammer Greenwood, he was the Chief Secretary of Ireland at the time. Number four was Neville McCready, he was put in charge of the army in Ireland. Number five was General Henry Hugh Tudor, he was a police advisor in Ireland. Number six, believe it or not, was an Irish man by the name of General Henry Hughes Wilson, he was an Irish Unionist from County Longford, and he was military advisor to David Lloyd George. And last but not least, number seven, Winston Churchill, who was a politician at the time, but he was also in charge of the army and the police. And more than anything, he wanted the IRA wiped out. 